Hi, everybody. Welcome to Long Island. He's Ray Ferraro. I'm James Cebulski. McKinnon's one of those guys who's an attraction selling tickets for this one, Ray. Dangerous offensive player. He can skate and shoot the puck. Any team would be lucky to have him. Enough talk, enough hype. Let's do this. Your first period is set to go. The Avalanche have established possession here early in this one as they win the draw. Throws it in. New York's got the puck along the boards. Colorado's got it now. Fails to find the open man. Slides the puck across to Lee. McKinnon's tripped up and the official's hand is in the air, signaling penalty. Lee's been nabbed for tripping. I guess it's a little bit of bad luck, James. I mean, he's reaching for the puck. He's in position to try and keep the play moving, but he trips him up. The Avs will have a chance to get on the power play for the first time this evening. And if you're one of these power play guys, James, you can't wait now. It's your first opportunity of the night. You get out on the power play, you want to make a difference. Puck knock loose in the neutral zone. Streaking through center, they go on the attack. The Avalanche have the puck in the defensive zone. Along the right wing, they enter the attacking area. And that one's broken up by a great defensive play. Puck clears the zone. The Avalanche have gained possession off the wall. Colorado's got it along the wall. Saad's been tripped up, and we got a penalty coming up here. There's the whistle. Here's the call from the officials. And he's off to the box for two for tripping. Not much of an argument there. A stick between the player's feet. The Avs roll out their man advantage unit, and they've got lots of time with this five on three. Too many times on a long five on three, the power play becomes static. Get it to the middle at the very least. Shoot it and make the penalty killers react. Puck move back to the neutral zone. The Avs have it behind the cage. And now it's over to Landeskog. Colorado's got it along the wall. New York's got possession while undermanned. And they'll get it out of the defensive end. The Avalanche have gained control of the puck along the wall. Colorado's got it across the line. Here he is, shot right in front, makes the glove stop. The most fun save for the goaltender, the glove stop. Lots of time left in this period. Still looking for our first goal. New York's got possession here in their own end. Tries to clear the puck. And they do just that. I thought they did a pretty good job there, James. That's a time you can get yourself running around in the zone. They didn't get there. Locks him down in front of the net. Smart defensive play there. Quick pass to Landeskog. Right in the slot. Oh, he's going to be shaking his head after that one. Yeah, you go back to the bench here, kicking yourself in the rear end. You've got a scoring chance, and you don't even get it on net. Sends it across. Here's a shot. And that banks off a stick. There's the whistle as the puck goes out of play. That's a pretty good scoring chance. That's a chance the shooter thinks might go in, but the goalie turns it aside. Joseph won the draw. Wrist shot from the slot. Stopped by the goaltender. Picked up along the wall by Saad. Great reflexes, another save. Yeah, he's pretty good positioning here, James. He makes the two stops back to back. And the puck is cleared to a safer spot. The Avs have it behind the net. Moves it to Saad. Slides the puck into the offensive zone. Right to the middle from point blank. Huge stick saved by the goaltender. Yeah, he got out tight to him, James. There's nowhere for that puck to go. Barlamov's taking a look up at the big board on the replay. He'll see his stick save was excellent. That was a good scoring chance. New York's got a hold of the puck. Here's a chance to get it out of their own end. And he gets the job done. Big thumbs up clearing that one. Passes the puck over to Saad. And he gains the zone here. Quick feed to Beauvillier. The Islanders' PK unit delivers in a big way. There's the whistle stopping play penalty coming up here. 
Now you react, you go to get the puck, and you stick your stick into the guy's feet. Down you go. Two minutes off to the box. The Avs send their man advantage unit out once more. They've been skunked on the power play so far tonight. So you have a little chat on the bench. Guys notice some things that the penalty killers do, and you try to adjust one step ahead of them. The Avs gain possession along the wall. Slides the puck across to Gerard. McKinnon's got it on the offensive end. Good reach for the stick to knock the puck away. Takes a shot. Traps that puck tight into his chest. We're still in the early stages of this period. The game is still scoreless. The Avs win it. And that carries off a stick. Taken along the wall by Rantanen. The Islanders will try to shave a few seconds off this penalty now. They get it out of the defensive end. Takes it at center. More time off the clock as they grab the puck. Here's a short pass to Bailey. Good heads up play in the defensive zone. The Avs gain control of the puck against the wall. Here they come up along the wing. Moves it quickly over to Landeskog. Pucks it away in his own end. They move the puck out of harm's way. Colorado's got a hold of it against the wall. Coming down the left wing and into the zone. Long reach breaks up the momentum. Trying to get the puck out of his own end. Cross the blue line and they'll get that much needed change, Ray. Yeah, they've got to get guys off the ice. They look tired, now you can get a fresh group on the ice. No quarter given here as they battle for the loose puck along the boards. Boychuk swooping in on the attack. And he regains control of the puck. Played big in the moment there. And he loses control of the puck. Moves it over to Saad. And pokes the puck loose inside the offensive end. Here's a chance to try to get it out of the defensive zone. Both teams back to even strength. Impressive job by the penalty killers on that play. All a good power play is about 20%, James. That one falls in the other 80%. They don't get it done. The power play expires. Nice stick work to knock the puck loose. From the point, they take control of it. Picked up along the boards by Jost. Takes a hit, he goes down to the ice and coughs up the puck. Kadri's hauled down, penalty on the way. Let's see the call here. Bailey's called for tripping, he's off to the box. They're gonna be down a man here. Once he gets his stick into the player's feet, it's almost inevitable a tripping penalty will result. Tough to argue that call. Colorado's power play unit puts their hard hats on as they go back to work. Back underway and they take possession here inside the offensive zone. Moves with the puck in the corner. Scores! On the man advantage! They took advantage of the extra time available with a manpower advantage and they're on the board. Manny laid a beauty of a pass across there. Enough air to clear the sticks and it lands perfectly on the shooter's stick. The Avalanche have taken a 1-0 lead near the midway mark of the first. I like the way they've played. They've been aggressive, got in on the forecheck pretty quickly, and now they're rewarded with a goal. Puck grab by Boychuk. By number 92. On the doorstep, comes up with a stop. Colorado's got a hold of it along the wall. Pokes it away to keep the pressure on. Colorado's got the puck. Along the side, here they come through the neutral zone. Sends it in deep. The Islanders scoop it up along the boards. Grabbed along the boards by Belmar. And he comes up with it. Oh, sometimes you think you got lots of room to make a move. Not there. He got closed down and hammered. What a hit. More than half the period left to play. The Avs lead it 1-0. And now it's grabbed by Everley. 
New York's got the puck against the boards and sends it just out of reach. And the goaltender grabs that one for a whistle to try to slow things down here. The Avs have had way more chances offensively, and as a result, they're leading in this one. Parzell's won the face-off deep inside the offensive zone. The Islanders ready to go on the attack. He almost lost it for a second there, but regains control of the puck. Oh, what a save with the stick by Grubauer. But he came out and challenged him. Good save. The Islanders get a hold of the puck along the boards. Well, I'm liking the way they're getting after this shift here, James. Really good effort. Centering pass, and that's blocked. The Avs have it against the wall. Quick pass to Donskoy. Now a quick pass to Calvert. Takes it into the slot. Change up, change up. Looks to set up at the point now. Passes right to the front, pokes it away. Excellent hand-eye coordination. Moved up ahead after a nice pass from the right wing. Here he is in front, scores! Well, I think we might be in for an anything you can do, I can do better sort of night. Yeah, this is starting to look like a game that can stretch out and end up in overtime. These teams are evenly matched. Good thing he one times his puck. The goalie almost gets there, but the pass is on his tape in the low slot, and he beats him clean. The setters will glide into the dot. And play resumes as the puck is dropped. Moves it to side. Receives the pass. And the traffic jam in front blocks the shot. Quick feed to Clutterbuck. Smart defensive play here in the open ice. And a souvenir for one lucky fan will bring us to a face-off on the ice. Plenty of playing time left in this frame. You can feel the energy in this crowd. It's a tie game. Nice job tying up his opponent. New York's moving the puck through center ice. Trying to get back on the attack now. Puck scooped up by Burakovsky. The Avs will play it from the defensive zone. Slides it to Taves. Great stick work with the steal. Not able to connect. The Islanders will take it behind the net. Brilliant save, read it perfectly. Off the crossbar. Komarov's frustration has to be at an all-time high. He's hit the post a couple of times. Uncle, how about a bounce for me, he's thinking. Hangs onto the puck. Couldn't make that one happen. Can't hang on after that hit. Takes a shot. Too much congestion in front. Colorado's got the puck against the half wall. Couldn't find the intended target. Can't keep a hold of the puck after that play. Here's a short pass to Komarov. Wax it into the offensive zone. Colorado's got the puck along the wall. Takes the feed from the left side. Here's an odd man rush. Strong defensive effort. Quick pass across to Sezikis. Taken by Clutterbuck. Scrum along the boards. And some good footwork to kick it away. And it's a quick pass to Belmar. Couldn't connect, although not exactly an ideal pass to begin with. And the puck escapes the zone, and they'll be forced to tag up. Colorado's gained possession along the boards. Great defensive play to come up with the puck. The Islanders looking against the half wall. And he comes up with the save! Marlomov's done nice work here on this scoring chance to turn it aside. Past the midway mark in this period. We are all tied up in this one. Play resumes as they win the draw here inside the offensive zone. There's another stop. Puck picked up by Cole. Good defensive effort to poke it away. Handles the puck. Nowhere for that shot to go through. Moves it quickly over to Bailey. Misses wide of the net. Not going to get many better chances from that. Dead center, right in the slot. Made the stop on that play. Oh, you're not going to get a better chance than that, but the goalkeeper does a great job. 
He didn't have much time to react. He got the pad on that quick shot. Puck possession so critical. Another face-off coming up here. Colorado's won the face-off deep in their own end. Donskoy's gaining momentum. The Islanders have it from their own end. The Avalanche have the puck in the open ice. Pass right on the doorstep. Oh. And we got a leader as he tucks it into the net. These teams are jammed together. That goal might open it up. When you get into this position, that puck's got to be off your stick in a hurry. You don't have much time to think about it. Colorado's now up by one. What's the strategy from here on in? It's to attack. There's no defending a one-goal lead with over two periods left. Go get another one. Barzell's won the draw. Scored by number 72, Puck grabbed by Lee. Pinned up along the boards. Scooped up along the wall by Lee. And now he moves it to Barzell. Puck scooped up by Johnson. Strong defensive effort. Colorado's got it in their own zone. Directs it on over to Burakovsky. Pumps the puck away. Nice pass. Quick pass to Eberle. And a nice poke check inside the neutral zone. Solid check to slow him down. Jocelyn for the puck and it's knocked away. Beautiful feed up ahead from the right wing side. Manages to hang on. Completely misses on the play. You don't even make the goalie work here. You've got to make him have to do something in the net. And that puck leaves the zone. And he uses his reach to disrupt the play. And now it's grabbed by Sizikas. And that one's turned away. Moves it to Rantanen. Steps into the offensive end. Tries to make a move and can't hang on to the puck. There are times you try to do too much. He's got good hands, but maybe a more simple play is the right one there. And the goalie covers up for the whistle. Grubauer's in great position here to make this stop. Nice work by the goaltender. New York's down, but not out. They've had chances, they just haven't capitalized. Nice start winning the draw here inside the offensive zone. Denies that opportunity. What do you think hurts more? He's got a headache or his jaw sore? That thing was a bullet. Quick feed to Nelson. Sends the pass over. Makes his presence known on the ice. Levels him with the hit. New York's got the puck along the boards. And tries to make a diagonal pass to Pullock. Delayed penalty coming up here by the official. There's the whistle, and here's the call. Joe's still intentions have resulted in a charging penalty. He'll be heading to the penalty box for a couple of minutes. That's a charging penalty every day of the week. Both teams lining up for the face-off, and it's a chance to see if there's actually some power in this power play. Well, good news for them as they trail by one, they get a power play. The key here, though, James, is to be confident without pressing. Just get the puck to the net, make the penalty killer stress. And a successful clearing attempt. Looks to pass it to Pacho. The abs will kill off a few extra seconds now. Puck is cleared out of the defensive zone. The Islanders gain possession along the wall. Through the neutral zone now, picking up steam. Takes the feed. He's off! Glove save! How did he get a piece of that? Nothing doing on that. Puck cleared from the defensive end. New York's got a hold of it against the wall. Looking dangerous as they move along the boards. Sends a pass over. Scores! That was impressive! Man, a bad power play can suck the life out of your team. One that looks like that and then scores a goal is a great boost. Get 
to the net. That's where the goals are. The rebound sits there and he puts it away. Just here in the late stages of this frame, the next goal could be a big one as we are tied. New York's won it, taken by Pellick. The Islanders played along the wing. Moves the puck down low. Inside the final minute of the first here. Picked up along the wall by Lee. Here's a shot and makes the save. Officials getting ready to drop the puck. Puck possession so key in today's game. They take possession as he locks him up off the faceoff. Puck battle along the boards. And it's kicked away. Here's a short pass to Clutterbuck. And they fail to go tape to tape. And as he opts to freeze the puck, we get a whistle. Starting to look like a little bit of a fire drill in the zone, so this is a good play. Comfers won a big draw in their own end. Grubauer's on top of the puck, and that'll stop the play. Pretty conservative play here, James, as he covers it up to kill the play. Comfers won the draw deep in the defensive zone. That's the horn, and period number one comes to an end after a very entertaining 20 minutes. Fans, take a look at our scoreboard as we acknowledge tonight's special group in attendance. Still lots of hockey still to come, so get ready here on EA Sports. Official has made his way back to center ice, and we are ready to go for period number two. And we are underway, still tied up here in the second. One period already in the books. Ray, how have you seen this thing? Grubauer's carried the ball in that first period, James. I think pretty easy to see. He's the main reason this game is tied. Knocks the puck away in the open ice. Maintains possession. Feeds the puck to Lee. And now he tries to get it across to Eberle. Slides the puck over. Quick pass to Barzell. New York's moving it up the ice. From the right wing, he moves it to the middle. Here's a howitzer at the net. Denied by Grubauer. James Sabalski, Ray Ferraro with you here in the early going of this period. We got a tie game. Kadri's won it off the faceoff. The Islanders gain control of the puck against the wall. Big play inside the defensive zone. Moves it quickly over to Saad. New York's got the puck here in the open ice. And loses possession after a solid hit. And now he angles it across to Burakovsky. The Islanders have a hold of it in the defensive zone. They go on the attack from the left side. Takes the pass. Right in front. Wrestling in close. And he denied that opportunity. I like the way he tracks the puck here. He's got to find it, and then he gets his body right in front of it. That's a good save. Stays with it. Denies it in front. Pins him against the boards as they battle for the loose puck. There's the whistle from the linesman calling it offside. Oh, he just got enough of that one to turn it aside. Play set to resume with the face-off ready to go. Center's jammed up and the winger grabs the puck. 
Taken along the wall by Jost. Quick pass to Donskoy. Slides it back to the blue line. Takes the feed. The blocker saved by Varlamov. Move to the middle. Here he is in close. Oh, and another big stop. That's why a goalie can never relax. He makes one stop. Now he's got to be sharp to make another. Sends it down low. Here he is in front. Stopped by the goaltender. The official signaling for a penalty as play is called. Tripping is the call. Did he sell or is that the right one in your no, mind? I think it's the right one. He looks like he's picking up speed and the stick gets into his feet. New York's got another opportunity here on the man advantage. I like the way that their plan has been successful and it's pretty obvious they're going to stay with that same mode. Off a stick. Colorado's got possession while under man. Here's a clearing attempt from their own end. And they get it down. That yeah, good communication. They talk to each other. They're in the right spot. They just clear it down the ice. Moves it to Beauvillier. The Islanders move it in. Move to the middle. And he was right there. They can't connect. Still early on in this frame, James and Ray with you. So glad you could join us. It's all tied up. Play resumes here as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. Scores! The go-ahead goal! Uh, this game has been tight. Now somebody's got a leg up. Well, the coaches were talking prior to the power play about a face-off play. It looks like they executed it perfectly. The Islanders are up by one here in the second. I've liked a lot of their game, but it's like they can't get these other guys to go away. It stays close, but at least they're playing from in front. Sent into the offensive zone. The Avalanche have the puck against the boards. And now it's grabbed by Landeskog. Nice puck check. McKinnon's caught with the hook and the official saw it. Here's the official call. The Islanders have been handed two minutes for hooking. I guess at a certain point you got to let the guy go, but he worries that he's out of position, so he tries to slow him down with a hook. Pretty cut and dry call. The Avs once again send out their power play unit. They deserve this power play. The last couple of shifts, they've been threatening for the tying goal. Finally, they earn a power play. Pumps it away to stay on the attack. Here's a chance. Gets in front of it. Quick feed to Landeskog. And that's blocked away. Komarov's got it along the boards. Gets the full use of his stick on the poke check. A spirited battle along the boards for the puck. From their own end, trying to kickstart this power play. Pokes the puck away. They've got numbers. It's a two-on-one. Stick saved by Varlamov. He's sharp on this one. Out on top of the crease aggressively to make the save. The Avs have it behind the net. Takes the feed from the wing. Excellent stick work on the play. Can't connect. Here's a short pass to Rantanen. He was locked in there. Picked up along the boards by Rantanen. Again, the denial by the goaltender. Really good stop. After he made the first one, he's got to find the puck, and he's in position again. Varlamov's hands are quick. He uses his stick to make this save on the scoring chance. Still lots of time left in the period. New York's got a 3-2 lead at this point. Colorado's got it, and they're on the attack. And a smart heads-up read to come up with the puck. New York's stick position is exemplary tonight. Teams can look at this on video and say that's how you defend the middle of the ice. The Islanders will try to shave a few seconds off this penalty now. And they get the puck out of harm's way. Colorado's got it in their own zone. Keeps hold of the puck. Loses possession after he takes a little hit. New York's got the puck now. And manages to clear the zone. The Avs will play the puck from behind the net. Through the open ice, they're picking up steam. Pokes it away here in the neutral zone. Pucks 
slid down the ice. Sends it over to Burakovsky. Colorado's in now. Moves it quickly over to Saad. Here's a chance to clear the puck from his own end. And a nice job by the Killers on that one. Yeah, now they can get a change, get some fresh players on the ice. Offside the call, and we'll have a face-off just outside the blue line. The Islanders have been the better team, leading in the shot department, and they lead it on the scoreboard. And they take possession. Nice job tangling him up on the draw. Slides it over with pace to Rantanen. Slides the puck to Johnson. Quick pass to Landeskog. And that's broken up with a stick in front. And that shot gets caught in traffic. Quick pass over to Everle. That pass doesn't go. Slides it across to Landeskog. Great pass from the left wing up the middle now. Moves it to Lee. Along the half wall with the puck. Quick feed to Rantanen. Moves the puck. Graves has it in the defensive end. And now it's over to Landeskog. Couldn't complete the play. Settles things down and gets control of it once again. And he gives it over to Landeskog. Colorado's got a hold of the puck. Went for the dirty dangle and it goes sideways. Rantanen's in good position to create a scoring chance, but he bobbles the puck and the chance is gone. With the steal. Slides it up to Rantanen. Receives the pass. Here's a short pass to Belmar. Oh, he'd like to have that pass back. New York's got the puck in the defensive end. Sends it quickly to Johnston. Handles the puck. Taken by Nachuskin. Feeds it over to Belmar. Jabs the puck away. And now it's grabbed by Hickey. Looking to set up offensively. And a poke check knocks the puck away. New York's looking to break out. The Avs have it against the wall. New York's got the puck inside the defensive zone. Moves it quickly over to Bailey. The Avs move the puck in the defensive zone. Into the offensive end now. The Islanders gain possession in their own end. They go on the attack through center. Here's a shot, shuts him down. Takes a bump but still hangs on to the puck. Pajot's dangerous in the offensive zone. He's got it now, and he's already got the go-ahead goal. All alone! Oh, man! Yeah, that wasn't very good. It looked like he was going to deke, and then he was going to shoot, and then he didn't either. Grubauer's been taking dangerous chances and throwing them to the curve all night. Here's another one. The Islanders are checking all the boxes tonight. More shots, more goals, and a lead in the second. Slides in off the wing after the centerman tied him up. New York's moving it along the wing. Moves the puck over to Komarov. And now he moves it quickly to Beauvillier. The Islanders take it along the wall. Shot! Stopped by the goaltender. Makar's taking it from his own end. Deflected away. Nice defensive use of the stick there. Kind of lost control for a second there, but regains possession. And he loses both the puck and his balance after that hit. Taken by Taves. Nice pass. Burakowski's got it into offensive territory. The Avs carried along the wall. Battle along the boards. Good defensive stop with the poke check. Great read to break up the play. Offside is the call, and we'll have a face-off just outside the offensive zone. Here in the back half of this period, New York's hanging on to this 3-2 lead. Barzell's won the draw here in the neutral zone. The Avs have it behind the cage. Takes the feed from his own end. Grabbed along the board by Pellick. Quick pass to Barzell. And skilled use of the stick to poke the puck away. The Avs will play it in their own end. Sends the pass over. Puck picked up by Comfort. Huge steal in his own end. He turns that puck over, but I get it. He's trying to make something happen while his team is behind. Scooped up along the wall by Graves. 
The Avs take it along the wall. Colorado's on the attack. Here's a chance, and the shot dies in the traffic jam. Johnson's got it across the line. Sends it over, and couldn't find the intended receiver on that one. Well, the endless slew of penalties that have been handed out continues here as yet another one is being dished out. So often in a, in a shifty little play, the, you're trying to get to the puck, you get your stick in the wrong spot, he steps on your stick and there's nothing you can do. New York's power play unit puts their hard hats on as they go back to work. Oh, here you go, another chance to score in the power play. They've done that earlier in the game. Here's another opportunity. Trying to get the puck out of harm's way. Gets it out of his own end. New York's gonna play the puck from behind the cage. Here they come inside the neutral zone. The Avs scoop it up along the boards. Takes the puck as the clock ticks down on the penalty kill. Gets it out of his own end. The Islanders will get some fresh legs out there as they continue this power play. From the right side, he goes to the middle of the neutral zone. Battling for it along the boards. Oh, Smart heads up play to put that one away. And they move the puck out of harm's way. The Islanders are on the attack. Rocks them. Takes the feed. And the puck clears the zone. The Islanders gain possession along the wall. Barzell's got a defensive in. On the attack along the boards. And now he moves it to Bailey. Sends a pass over. Oh, that just goes wide. Hit the net. No chance to score if you don't get the puck on target. Nice defensive robbery with the stick. The Avs will kill off a few extra seconds now. Puck moved back to center, forcing them to regroup. New York's got it behind the net. Slides the puck over and tries to make a diagonal pass to Bailey. Off his stick! Oh, the reactionary save! If you could rerun that, that hit was big. I don't know if he thought he had more room than that, but he doesn't. That's a big hit right there on the body. The Islanders have generated plenty of quality scoring chances and a big reason why they lead late in the second period. Off the draw and a nice job locking up his opponent. And they managed to clear it. The Islanders get a hold of the puck along the boards. Can't maintain possession. Dished on over to Everly. And we've got a two on one. Johnson's teammates kill off the penalty. Oh, when the puck moves and the feet don't, this is what you get. You have lots of zone time, but no real dangerous chances on that power play. Moves it to Letty. Takes the pass. New York's got the puck along the boards. Pachot's got it in the offensive zone. And that one stopped. Another stop by the goaltender. He's right on it. Two consecutive saves. Tough ones at that. Grubauer's able to make the save as we see here. This is a good scoring chance, but he's in good position. Late goings of this period. The Islanders are giving their fans something to cheer about as they lead it 3-2. Locks him up on the draw as they take possession. Centered out in front. An easy save by Grubauer. Gerard's moving the puck through his own zone. Here's a chance to his teammate. What a steal in his own end. And now he tries to get it across to Johnston. The Avalanche have the puck in the defensive zone. Quick feed to McKinnon. Colorado's got the puck along the wall. Drills him. Puts it up front. Here he is, wrists it on net. He scores! That's Miko Rantanen! Really good tip here. He got himself into position so he could deflect it, and it ends up in the net. even things up here in the late stages of this second period. Working to get this game back to square has not been an easy road, but now it's a short game as we enter the last little bit of the second period. The Avalanche have taken possession in their own end. Burakovsky's carrying it ahead. 
New York's got a hold of it along the wall. Here's a short pass to Komarov. Into the attacking area from the left side. And he easily stops that one. The centermen glide into position. Kadri's won the faceoff. Almost lost the puck, but hangs on here as play continues. Tosses it on to Kadri. From the slot, gives them nothing in front. Well, not exactly a banner night for the goaltenders as the second period comes to an end. At least they'll get a breather here. Programs for tonight's game are available on the concourse. Featuring complete player listings for both teams, player bios, and informative stories. And we'll be right back for what should be a very intriguing third. Seem fresh after that second intermission. We're ready to drop the puck on period number three. There's been no shortage of firepower after the first 40 minutes, and we are underway here in the third. Moves it quickly over to Barcel. Can't get it to go. His reflexes on display tonight. Good use of the body to knock them off the puck. And now it's grabbed by McKinnon. The Islanders grab possession to the puck. Look out, a two on one. Misses the net. You're going to go back and kick yourself for that one because he wants that on the net. He doesn't miss it by much. Nice speed from the left side up the middle. Good heads up play in the defensive zone. Slides the puck down low. Set it out in front, and that one's broken up. Great block there. Picked up along the wall by Rantanen. Up along the wing. And there's a lucky souvenir for someone in the crowd as the puck heads out of play. Bowers probably had a few saves tonight. He's felt better about than that one, but he got just enough of it to keep it out of the net. Lots of time left in this period. We are all tied up in this one. Colorado's won the draw in the neutral zone. The Avs played along the boards. Here's a chance. Nice save by the keeper to trap that puck in his chest. Puck possession so critical. Another face-off coming up here. And momentum on their side as they win the draw here. They stars! They've got the lead now. Everybody's up on the bench. They've got the energy. You want to push forward. Man, the goalie's going to look at his teammates and say, is anybody going to cover the high slot? He was so open, he was able to hammer home the one-timer. Colorado's got the one-goal lead here in this third period. What's the strategy now in your mind, Coach? I don't think you change at all. I, I also don't know in today's game how you defend or be conservative. You're just inviting trouble to do that. The Islanders have it now. Quick feed to Nelson. Looking to make something happen along the boards. Quick pass to Pacho. And that one's blocked. Pushes it across to Saad. Denied by the goaltender. The Islanders have had plenty of good looks, but they still trail early in this third period. Colorado's got it in the offensive zone. Great save by Varlamov. We're still in the early stages of this period. The Avs are hanging on to this one goal lead. They'd love to add another. Good read by the winger as the two centers tie up. New York's in transition. Puts it in deep. Pinned up along the boards. 
New York's got the puck along the wall. Colorado's looking to break out of their own end. Gaining momentum along the wing. Right out front. Wow. Scores! Oh, what a one-timer to bury it! This really good puck work here as they move it around. The opening is for the guy in the low slot, but he's by himself and he's able to one time at home. The Avs with a quick strike in this third period. What a difference that changes the outlook of this game. A one to two goal lead in the third period becomes a big deal. By number 11. Don Skoy has got the puck. Assisted by number 72. Makes a move in front. Oh, what a stop with the blocker by Varlamov. Puck grab by Komarov. Moves right to the middle, and that one's broken up. The Avs move it ahead. Slides it quickly to Don Skoy. Lays into the body on the play. New York's on the attack. The Islanders have it against the wall. With the stop. Grubauer's goaltending at one end and the offensive output at the other has made for a good night. Now we'll get another look at this. That's a good shot, but the goalies get the blocker up to make the save. The Islanders have been the better team tonight, but they still trail on the scoreboard early in this third period. Puck is dropped and he wins the draw here in the defensive zone. And he slides it quickly to Comfer. Gets the puck in deep. New York's got a hold of it against the wall. Johnson's lugging the puck. Moves it over to Clutterbuck. Loves the puck into the corner of the offensive zone. Picking up some steam at center ice. Puck knocked loose in neutral zone. Just a great defensive read there. The Islanders have been in such good position all night long. Stick position is critical as they continue to intercept a lot of passes. Good hit to knock the puck loose. New York's gained possession along the boards. Couldn't complete the play. No quarter given here as they battle for the loose puck along the boards. Find some space in the corner. How did he stop that one? Yeah, he's a sharp save, James. Right in the middle of the ice, he makes the stop and pushes it away. Here's a chance. Makes the save. right on top of this scoring chance. Nowhere for the puck to go. The Islanders still trail in this third period despite numerous scoring opportunities. The Avs win the draw. Denied by the goaltender. Bailey stick handling in his own zone. Moves it around along the half wall. The Avalanche have gained possession off the wall. Moves it to Kadri. Here they come up along the wing. Grabs control of it at the point. New York's got control of it now from their own end. Takes the feed. Puck scooped up by Barzell. Pokes it away in his own end. Good battle along the boards for the puck. Barzell's looking to make something happen here in the corner. Strong defensive effort. The Avs are in transition. Puck sent in deep and they'll change things up on the back end. Colorado's going to play it from the corner. Pajot's got the puck in his own zone. Quick feed to Marcel. Comes up with the stop. The Avalanche have gained control of the puck along the wall. Along the side, here they come through the neutral zone. And that one fired right into the bench. Boston's the final city on this road trip here, Ray. There's a light at the end of the tunnel here. And it's a good thing it's coming, too. I mean, there's been ups and downs on the road trip. There isn't almost any time you get out on the road for consecutive games. Taken by Hickey. With possession along the wall. Bumped off the puck. Here's a short pass to Lee. Denied by Grubauer.
still lots of time left here in this frame. It's a two-goal game with a 5-3 score. New York's won the draw. Moves it quickly over to Beauvillier. Moves the puck. Sacrifices the body. Carries it in. Hangs onto the puck. Quick pass to Graves. Here's a chance. Oh, what a stop by Varlamov. Brantanen's going to play it against the half wall. And the defenders come up with the puck. The Islanders have had more chances offensively, but they have not been able to convert trailing here in this third. New York's got it in the defensive zone. Dumps it in. The Avalanche have possession along the boards. There's the whistle. Penalty coming up. Pretty cut and dry to call that a charge. It is because as soon as the puck turns over, you can see that he's adjusted and he's going to finish this check. The ref's on high alert. The Avs send their man advantage unit out once more. Sometimes it's just your night and the way that they've performed on the power play. It kind of feels like they're going to get another one. Denies him on the slapper! Time of the penalty, 10 minutes, 21 seconds. James and Ray with you tonight. More than half the period has been played. Colorado's got a two-goal cushion here. They lead it 5-3. Moves it to Saad. And that's broken up. Through center along the wing. He almost lost it for a second there, but regains control of the puck. Good use of the body on the play. Quick feed to Saad. Puck picked up in the open ice. Here's a short pass to Burakovsky. A chance in front! Turns it away. Along the boards, they battle for the puck back and forth. With the stop. New York's got the puck shorthanded. A chance right in front! Stopped by the goaltender. And the puck's booted away. Sezikis plays it along the wall. Colorado's got the puck along the boards. New York's gained possession. The Avs have a hold of it in the defensive zone. Through the open ice, they're picking up steam. Let's it go from the slot. That's wide of the net. You can go games without a chance from here. Puck picked up by Rantanen. They fight for it along the boards. The Islanders gain control of the puck against the wall. Good defensive effort to poke it away. Last call here on this man advantage. Yeah, the power play's got to get the puck up the ice with a little bit of urgency. Colorado's got it against the boards. Right side set up ahead into the middle of the ice. Moved out in front! Stopped by the goaltender. The Islanders will kill off a few extra seconds now. Getting a little too physical to maintain possession. Here inside the defensive zone, they get the puck. Komarov's out of the box. He owes a lot of credit to that penalty killing unit. Well, these penalty killers have been on the same page from the drop of the puck tonight. They have been outstanding when they've been a man down. Battle along the boards. Nice poke check inside the attacking zone. Moves it quickly over to Burakovsky. Fired into the offensive zone and they'll make some changes. The Avalanche have the puck on the attack. The Islanders take over on possession. From the defensive zone, they move the puck around. Sends it in on the attack. Colorado's got a hold of it along the wall. The Avs will play it from the defensive zone. Colorado's got the puck at center. New York's looking to break out of their own end. Scrum along the boards. And pokes the puck loose inside the offensive end. Lee's picking up steam. Quick pass to Nelson. Colorado's got the puck along the wall. Moves it to Nichuskin. Receives the pass. Smart defensive play there. Colorado's grabbed a hold of the puck. Shot on net, and there's the save. Those are the saves that are gifts from the goaltender. That looked like an automatic goal. He's able to make the stop. A big face-off here inside the offensive end.
While the centers are jammed up, nice job by the winger to steal the puck. The Islanders play it along the boards. Tries to the crease. Colorado's got the puck. Scrum ensues along the boards. Taken along the wall by Pellick. Quick feed to Everly. Handles the puck. And that's blocked. Along the wing up the neutral zone. And he whiffs on it. And that one's broken up by a great defensive play. Barzell swooping in on the attack. The Avalanche have it in their own zone. Here they come. Takes control of the puck. Can't connect. Slides it on over to Beauvillier. Centering pass! Denies him! He got all of it! Nice pass. Puts a little mustard on the hit to knock the puck loose. And now he angles it across to Sezikis. Colorado's got the puck inside the defensive zone. And they'll be forced to tag up after that missed pass. Scrum along the boards as they battle for the puck. Colorado's got a hold of it against the wall. Big play inside the defensive zone. Intercepts it at center. Shot! Oh, what a good opportunity right there. You don't get many chances. You want to finish them off, so he'll be a little frustrated as he heads back up ice. I wanted another look at this one. I'm sure you guys were all impressed as I was. What a save by the goalie. Getting into the later stages of this period, Colorado's got all sorts of content for the highlight shows tonight. They lead at 5-3. Here's a short pass to Gerard. Referee's got his hand up, signaling a delayed penalty. And the play is whistled dead. Let's see what the call is made. Clutterbuck's elbow a little too high in the eyes of the officials. He makes the same play, but finishes with his shoulder, James. There's no penalty. This is an elbowing call. Dangerous. As we're about to drop the puck, more pressure on this critical kill here as the penalty killing unit goes back to work. As someone who played a lot on the power play, you get one early in a game, it gives you more confidence. He scores! What a birthday present. You come to the ring feeling pretty good about yourself, but now you bang one in. We're not quick enough, we're not in the right position. In any case, the goalie gets just a little piece of the shot, and it's in the net. Colorado's on fire tonight, and they show no signs of slowing down in the third. This has been almost a perfect hockey game for them. When they look at the video, they're going to be really happy. And now it's grabbed by Graves. And he'll take a moment to regroup back at center. Can't catch up to the pass. Nice poke check. Through the neutral zone, moving the puck along the side. Moves it quickly over to Nelson. Can't keep a hold of it as he's jostled off the puck. Passes over to Johnson. And just hitting the final minute now in regulation of this blowout. Tripped up on the play. Delayed penalty coming up. Denies him! Picked up along the boards by Graves. Quick pass to Rantanen. Denies him in close. Big save by the goaltender once again. Official blows the whistle. Let's see what the call is. The Islanders are going to be shorthanded, tripping the call. Reaching for the puck, trying to be in position. You're just a little bit away, and then you get nabbed for tripping. Yeah, it's always tough to use the I got stuck excuse, right? It never works. Play resumes here as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. Kick save. Oh, he's dialed in tonight. New York's going to be able to kill a few seconds off now with the puck. Colorado's got it from behind the net. Through the neutral zone now, picking up steam. Gerard's got it against the boards. Scores! And with that goal, it's a milestone moment for him. Career point number 100. Now he can start thinking about the next 100. Because as soon as you get one milestone, you start looking to the next. Is that Green Eraser? Yes, I like it. Oh, the 
Goalie's going east on a westbound street. That puck deflects off the defender and goes into the net. The Avs have pummeled their opponents tonight. They have been the busier team offensively and have converted numerous times here in this third period. Parcells won it. Puck grab by Boychuk. Moves into the slot. Stones him in front. Yeah, that's in a dangerous spot. He makes a good save here. And he slides it quickly to Rantanen. Centering pass. Snaps one here in the slot. And he gets a paddle on that one. This is a quality chance that the goaltender turns aside right from the slot. Grubauer's a little bit fortunate there. He makes a terrific stop, but he just gets a piece of it to keep it out of the net. The Avs lead it late in this third period. McKinnon's won the draw here in the offensive zone. Moves it to Landeskog. And that brings an end to this one here this evening. And the beat goes on, and it's amazing how they continue to find different ways to lose here during this run. Play some really good portions of games and then find a spot in the game where they blow up. They make a mistake, and they just can't get it back. For my broadcast partner, Ray Ferraro, my name is James Cebulski. Thanks so much for joining us. Good night.